Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. The new update iOS 26 brought some flashy changes, especially that liquid glass design. But honestly, I miss the classic iOS 18 look cleaner, faster, and more familiar. Did you just update to iOS 26 and feel like the new liquid glass UI is just not your vibe? It's flashy, sure, but maybe you missed the clean classic iOS 18 look. What if I told you that you can go back to the iOS 18 style without downgrading and most importantly, with no data loss? In this video, I'll show you how to disable or customize the iOS 26 liquid glass look using built-in settings and safe tweaks, so your iPhone feels just like it used to. Let's jump into it. First of all, plug your iPhone or iPad to computer via USB cable. This method doesn't require update or backup data, just back to iOS 18 style and make your iDevice faster and still get iOS 26 features. You need a tool called Kawabunga Lite to apply the tweaks. Download Kawabunga Lite on their official website or you can check the link download on description. You can download Kawabunga Lite for Windows or Mac. Download it and install Kawabunga on your computer. On this video, I'll make tutorial for Windows user, but I'll insert the guide for Mac user as well. Then launch Kawabunga Lite on your computer. If you can't connect or can't open Kawabunga Lite on your computer, you must install iTunes first so you can open and connect your device to Kawabunga without errors. Don't forget to disable Windows Defender to run Kawabunga. Then click refresh button till your device detected on Kawabunga Lite. After connected you need to liquid glass disable or call bye bye solarium to get back iOS 18 style. On this website, you can follow the guide for Windows or Mac. Download the file first. Then extract it on your computer. If you are a Windows user, go to step 3. Then copy file explorer address and paste it to Windows Explorer bar address. Then click your UDID folder. Click control center folder. After that, open the liquid glass folder that you downloaded earlier. Open it on new tab Windows Explorer. Click liquid glass enable. Then copy and replace managed preference domain folder to Kawabunga Lite folder. After that, close the window and go back to Kawabunga Lite. On Kawabunga Lite, go to Tab Control Center, then check Modify to enable it. Then go to Apply section. Before clicking Apply Tweaks, ensure you have disabled Find My on your iDevice. You can enable it later after the process finish. After that, click Apply, and your device will reboot. Don't worry, your data will be safe. But if you worry about this tips, you can back up your device first to make it safe. After restarted, you can check the setting, control center, and boom. You can go back to iOS 18 style without downgrading, and you can still use iOS 26 features, and still use iOS 18 style without lag and error anymore. If you are Mac user, you can follow the guide on the website, cause for Mac user, the step is very simple for Kawabunga Lite. And that's it. You've now removed the flashy liquid glass effects from iOS 26 and brought back the iOS 18 style, all without downgrading or losing any data. If this video helped you, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more iPhone tips, tricks, and updates.